new tonight at 10, a state education commissioner is threatened to close the Marlin School District due to low test scores. Now the city is scrambling to figure out another solution. As 25 News reporter Olivia Levada reports, tonight the mayor held a discussion regarding potential school closure plans. There's a lot on the line for Marlin ISD. After years of failing test scores and low rankings, the people of Marlin say the bad news seems to get closer every day. And I'm just concerned about what's going to happen come springtime. On the verge of closing down, a Texas Education Commissioner has threatened to shut down the school district. Concerned Marlin ISD parent Trina Bahati says that's why she attended Tuesday's town hall meeting regarding those plans. My kids in kindergarten, we got a lot more years to go, so I'm really concerned about education. Meanwhile, Mayor Carolyn Lofton is trying to keep hope alive. Well, I'm hoping to provide some clarity as to the impact the closing of a school in, in Marlin would do to the community or what that would look like and why, you know, putting some type of measure in place is essential to Marlin going forward. And the question that we have to ask ourselves is, as people who care about the future of the city, is what type of disadvantage is it for our students if they are forced to be shipped to schools. The city of Marlin recently bringing in former Waco ISD superintendent Dr. Marcus Nelson to help explore the application process for Marlin ISD to become a charter school. It's to provide an avenue for our children to have a place to go for a public education. So in the event that Marlin ISD closes, so we need to have a backup plan in place and that's what we're looking to do. The overall goal? keeping education local. Well, because without a school, a community dies. City officials say the state education commissioner is supposed to make a decision regarding the future of Marlin ISD this March. Olivia Leveda, 25 News, Marlin. Olivia, thank you. They also say a city operated charter school isn't the only option they're looking at to save their schools as they're exploring additional avenues.